the Synthetic Diamond Screener by Presidium. Power and starting up. To begin, ensure there is nothing within the testing area inside the device. The Synthetic Diamond Screener by Presidium can be powered by batteries or via its USB port. Remove the battery cover at the bottom of the device. Insert four AAA alkaline batteries. Replace the battery cover to secure the batteries. Press and hold the power button to switch on. The light will blink for about one minute to indicate the device is starting up. When the light stops blinking and is steadily lit in blue, the device is ready for use. Alternatively, you may connect the USB port at the back of the device to a power source. Using the provided power cable and power adapter, connect to a power source. Press and hold the power button to switch it on. The light will blink for about one minute to indicate the device is starting up. When the light stops blinking and is steadily lit in blue, the device is ready for use. If the power button starts to blink in red, it indicates low battery or that the device is faulty. Testing will not be able to proceed. Change the batteries or contact Presidium regarding the fault. The Synthetic Diamond Screener works on colourless diamonds of D colour to J colour, screening type 2A diamonds, which are usually synthetic CVD or HPHG diamonds, from natural diamonds. It does not work in detecting other colourless simulant stones. You should ascertain if your stone is a colourless diamond before using this device.